if your MacBook Pro is not charging and you know you have a good working charger, once you plug in and you see your light is not coming on, first thing which you can do, you can clean your charging port right here. You can use a Q-tip to clean it up. And if it's still not charging, then most likely you're gonna have to replace your charging port. This is new charging port. I'll put link in the description below. You can purchase one of them on Amazon. This is the tools I'm gonna be using to replace charging port. First thing you'll have to do, you'll have to remove back cover. Remove your back cover. And now you'll have to disconnect every cable from a logic board. First one, I'm gonna disconnect the battery. You're just gonna have to pry it off carefully. Then there's one more cable right here. Have to pry it off carefully as well. Then the next cable right here, you'll have to take this little piece of plastic off. And right here, there's a little clip that you have to lift it off. I don't know if you can see it or not. And then remove this cable very carefully. Everything is very fragile here. Same thing, one more cable over here. You have to lift this piece off. And then pull the cable off. Then there's one more cable right here. Another one right over here. One more right here. We'll have to disconnect fan. Just pull it up. There's one more cable right over here. You have to pull this cable off. One more right here. And then pull this one off as well. And then there is one more last one. This is a screen cable. So total, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven cables needs to be disconnected from logic board. Then I'm gonna take the fan off. Okay, next we need to take all the screws from logic board. Also at the same time, go ahead, take the screws off from the charging port, one right here and one right over here. And also there is a bracket that holds monitor cable and it also holds the charging port cable. You'll have to unscrew this one too. Now we can remove logic board. Actually, before removing logic board, we'll have to disconnect speaker. It's right over here. You'll have to pry it off the speaker because it has double-sided tape. That's why I'm gonna use flathead screwdriver. Be really careful when you prying it off. And now we can pull the logic board out. Right here, this is the charging port that we're gonna replace. 
and we can just disconnect from the logic board. This is my old one and I'll install the new one. Logic board is very dirty. I'm going to clean it up really quick. I'm going to install logic board back into the spot. Be really careful with cables. Once you install your logic board, we can start putting screws back in the logic board. Okay, once we have all the screws back in the logic board, now we need to connect every single cable. Now we need to put cover back on. Once we have everything back on, now let's go ahead and test the charging port. Looks like it's charging. You can see red light over here. So replacing a charging port, fix the charging issue on this laptop. Thanks for watching.